shoppers were greeted by protesters in the southwest today who say the supermarket giant is using a loophole that is costing taxpayers millions of dollars. A union that represents millions of workers across the nation says Walmart is shifting the cost of employee health care onto the taxpayers. They claim Walmart is doing this by lowering wages and hours to the point where their employees then qualify for, Medi for Medi-Cal under the Affordable Health Care Act. Now, this loophole is not illegal, but the group claims it's unfair. Walmart is the nation's largest employer. Last year, they took in $444 billion in revenue. The CEO, Michael Duke, made $21 million. Walmart can afford to insure its workers. The taxpayers should not have that burden. Everybody, right now, there is legislation called AB 880. That would force employers to pay a fine each time their worker ends up on Medi-Cal. However, a coalition of farmers in the Central Valley says this legislation would be devastating to the local farm industry, which relies on seasonal workers. They say it would have a chilling impact all across the valley.